and language are not necessarily the words that we speak. Language could literally mean the feeling that the words we speak bring. I often hear people say, he used a bad language. Not your language, your community language or your tribe language, but the feeling your words speak, no matter which language you speak, but what are those feelings that your words generate to those people who understand your language? That's literally the insight of a language. So as a salesman or woman, as a sales representative, as a businessman or woman, as an entrepreneur, learn to use a good language. Learn to communicate well. Because that will decide whether those customers that you have will come the second time. They might have landed on your business by accident, but retaining them would really 90% depend on how you'll handle them, how you speak to them, how you will welcome them, how you will send them off. So learn to communicate well. There are words that we take for granted. Sir, mom, madam, dear. We just think that offering that will take something away from us. No. Even if you call everybody sir, you won't lose anything. And that will make your customers so much happy. So learn how to communicate. Whenever someone decides to leave other people, all other businessmen and women, and decide to come, to step on your doorstep, and they want to buy from you. Learn how to respect them. Learn how to handle them well so that they can be motivated to come back next time. Your communication will decide whether your customers will come back or not. Thank you.